Hey guys, welcome back to What's in My Glass. I'm Andy and I have another 12 drinks of Christmas for you from me and my elf onesie. I have the perfect little holiday cocktail for you. This is great for Christmas Eve. You're just relaxing on the couch, watching Christmas vacation, and maybe you're like my family, uh, and we open pajamas on Christmas Eve. So this is the perfect little mug of deliciousness to enjoy. This is called the Santa's Nightcap. I will link the uh, blog where I got the recipe for this uh, below. I, I found it and to be completely honest, I was gonna show you all the steps, but she does a fantastic job and has all these beautiful photos. So I'm just gonna sip this and tell you about it. So really easy peasy. Uh, this is a chai tea based uh, cocktail. So first you gotta make some chai tea. Uh, you can make as much or as little of this as you want. Uh, she has a recipe online that uh, I think has six cups of water um, in a pot. So you can do that or you can just make a mug of it. So obviously just make some chai tea. Um, she lets it steep for a good long time, about 15, 30 minutes, uh, just to really deliver those punchy chai flavors. So cinnamon, nutmeg, clove, all those delicious kind of holiday flavors. Um, so make that first. Step two is to stir in some milk and some honey. Um, really yummy, sweeten it up a little bit, but not too much. Then you add some cinnamon sticks and some ginger to the pot as well. And then finally, bourbon. And I bet you think, oh man, it's gonna talk about bullet bourbon. You know what, for this, makers. There's not a lot of this makers left and I wonder why. <laughs> this is one of my favorite bourbons as well. Super yummy, a little sweet um, and really rich and spicy. So to the six cups of uh, hot water that you make with the chai tea and then you add about four cups of milk, you're adding about one and a half cups of bourbon, which is delicious. It'll warm you up from inside out. Oh my God, so good. I love everything about Maker's Mark. It was one of my favorite visits down in Kentucky. I love the bottle, I love the label, I love the history, uh, and I love the damn product too. So this is a great one for, uh, for this cocktail in particular. So you just heat that mixture through, ladle it into your favorite festive mug and enjoy. I know I do. So cheers guys. Hope